Welcome to Cyber World YT. Like and subscribe if you are new here. Also, follow me on Instagram for in case of any queries. Let's get started. Before we dive into the world of mobile camera hacking, I want to be crystal clear. This information is for educational purposes only. My goal is to make you aware of the potential dangers lurking in the digital world, not to encourage any illegal activities. Remember, hacking into someone's device without permission is a crime with serious consequences. Now that we've got that covered, let's explore the fascinating and sometimes unsettling world of mobile camera hacking. Our smartphones have become extensions of ourselves. They are not just tools, they are our constant companions always within arm's reach. We rely on them for a multitude of tasks, making our lives more convenient and connected. We use them for everything from banking to dating, managing our finances with a few taps and swipes, and finding love or companionship with just a flick of a finger. These devices hold our most personal information, from our bank details to our intimate conversations. We share our lives through photos and videos, capturing moments big and small and storing them in our digital galleries. These memories are precious, and we trust our smartphones to keep them safe. But have you ever stopped to think about the potential consequences if someone gained unauthorized access to your phone's camera? The idea of a stranger peering into your private life is unsettling, to say the least. Imagine a stranger watching your every move, listening to your conversations, and observing your daily routines. This invasion of privacy could happen without you even realizing it, as hackers can operate in the shadows, undetected. All through the lens of your own device, your smartphone could become a tool for surveillance. This thought is not just a paranoid fantasy, it's a chilling reality that many have already faced. It's a chilling thought, but a very real threat. Cybersecurity breaches are becoming more common, and the methods used by hackers are increasingly sophisticated. They can exploit vulnerabilities in your phone's software to gain access to your camera and microphone. That's why it's crucial to understand how hackers operate and what steps you can take to protect yourself. By staying informed and vigilant, you can safeguard your privacy. Use strong passwords, keep your software updated, and consider installing security apps to add an extra layer of protection. Your smartphone is a powerful tool, but it's up to you to ensure it remains a safe one. One of the most common methods hackers use to gain access to mobile devices is phishing. It's a social engineering technique where attackers send deceptive messages, often disguised as legitimate emails or text messages, to trick you into revealing sensitive information. These messages might prompt you to click on a malicious link or download an infected attachment. Once you take the bait, the hacker can install malware on your device, giving them access to your camera and other personal data. Malware, short for malicious software, is a catch-all term for any software designed to harm your device or steal your information. In the context of mobile camera hacking, malware can be particularly dangerous. Once installed on your phone, it can operate silently in the background, granting hackers access to your camera without you even realizing it. They can then spy on you, record videos, or even take pictures without triggering any visible signs that your device has been compromised. Section 5. Rats, taking control from afar. Rats, or remote access trojans, are a particularly insidious type of malware that gives hackers complete control over your device. Once a rat infects your phone, the attacker can remotely activate your camera, access your files, and even record your keystrokes. They can essentially control your phone as if it were their own, all without your knowledge. Section 6. Kali Linux, the Hacker's Toolkit. Kali Linux is a Debian-based operating system specifically designed for penetration testing and ethical hacking. It is a powerful tool used by cybersecurity experts around the world. It comes pre-installed with a wide range of tools that security professionals use to identify and exploit vulnerabilities in computer systems. These tools are essential for conducting thorough security assessments and ensuring that systems are robust against potential attacks. While Kali Linux itself is not illegal and can be used for ethical purposes, it is important to understand the ethical implications of using such powerful tools. 
Ethical hacking involves using these tools to improve security, not to cause harm. Some tools within it can be used for malicious activities, including mobile camera hacking. This highlights the dual-use nature of many cybersecurity tools, which can be used for both good and bad purposes. Understanding how these tools work is crucial for developing effective defenses against them. By learning how hackers operate, security professionals can better protect systems and data from malicious attacks. This knowledge is not just for those in the cybersecurity field. It is valuable for anyone who wants to understand the digital world and protect their personal information. In addition to its practical applications, Kaylee Linux also serves as an educational platform. Many universities and training programs use it to teach students about cybersecurity and ethical hacking. This hands-on experience is invaluable for those looking to enter the field. Setting up a virtual lab environment with Kali Linux allows students and professionals to practice their skills in a controlled setting. This helps them to understand the complexities of cybersecurity and prepares them for real-world challenges. Whether you are a seasoned professional or just starting out, Kali Linux is an indispensable tool in the world of cybersecurity. It empowers users to protect systems, understand threats, and contribute to a safer digital environment for everyone. Section 7. Protecting your digital eyes. Now that you have a better understanding of the methods and tools hackers use, let's talk about how you can protect yourself from becoming a victim. One of the most important things you can do is to be cautious about the links you click and the attachments you download, especially from unknown senders. Always double-check the sender's address and be wary of messages that seem too good to be true. Section 8. Stay informed, stay safe. The world of cybersecurity is constantly evolving, with new threats emerging all the time. That's why it's crucial to stay informed about the latest security risks and best practices for protecting your devices and data. Keep your operating system and apps up to date, as updates often include security patches that address known vulnerabilities. Consider using a reputable mobile security app to add an extra layer of protection to your device. Section 9. Join the CyberWorld community, where technology enthusiasts and cybersecurity experts come together to share knowledge and insights. If you want to dive deep into the fascinating world of cybersecurity, including learning about mobile camera hacking, data breaches, and other critical topics, I encourage you to subscribe to CyberWorld on YouTube. Our channel is dedicated to providing you with the most up-to-date information and tutorials. I regularly share informative videos on the latest security threats, hacking techniques, and practical tips for staying safe online. Remember, knowledge is power, and staying informed is your first line of defense. By understanding the risks and taking appropriate precautions, you can significantly reduce your chances of falling victim to cybercrime. Whether you're using your smartphone, laptop, or any other device, it's crucial to stay vigilant and proactive about your digital security. Stay safe, stay informed, and I'll see you in the cyber world. Together, we can build a safer digital future for everyone.